Justin Tachenko's electorate covers most of the Motu Koita villages. In last night's Talk Pixar program, Mr. Tachenko said the Motu Koita Assembly has not been performing its mandated duties in service delivery over the years. He said he is not going to go through the Assembly to roll out infrastructure and social projects. Schooling, rubbish collection, all these things in the village situation. Um, and whether that's being done or not, that's for Miria to explain to his people. But for us, it's to service the people as my voters and the services that they need. Assembly Chairman Miria Kupu denied allegations of abuse. He said he respects the MP's position but explained that lack of funding from NCDC since 2007 has disabled the Assembly's efforts in delivering services. The services are not being provided. The money is not being given to the Motukweta Bo Assembly, which was mandated to receive that money and provide the services as, as mandated in the election. Mr. Ikupo revealed that a report has been sent to the city manager directing the NCDC board and management to make available over 50 million Kina outstanding entitlements to the Assembly. Mr. Ikupu said copies of the letter will be made available to Prime Minister Peter O'Neill and Governor Powis Pakop. And I want the Prime Minister to call her, to probe into NCDC, please. The Motu Koita Assembly believes the indigenous landowners have been deprived of major infrastructure and social projects over the years. Bernadette Effie, National MTV News.